Hey guys, welcome back to the Game Replay. I'm Dave the Usher. The game we're playing is Final Fantasy VII for the PC. Okay, here we are in Cloud's flashback. It's a pretty cool flashback. You know, meeting Sephiroth, going back to Cloud's hometown. Childhood friend Tifa. Big re It's a reunion of friends, right? And, uh, you know, this is crazy. So we're on our way to the reactor, and there's probably going to be crazy monsters along the way. Let's get going. It gets harder from here. Follow me. <laughs> what about you guys? Anything to say? Let's hurry. Let's hurry. Uh, the bridge! Everyone seems to be all right. Will we be able to get back? These caves are intertwined like an ant farm. Oh, and Sephiroth? One person seems to be missing. Hmm. It may sound cruel, but we've no time to search for him. We can't go back, so we must go on. We'll travel together from here. All right, everyone enter Cloud's body. And speaking of one party, why don't I go to the menu? It, this is kind of for fun, you can't really do much. First of all, Cloud's at level one and his picture is actually a little different. He looks a little different, younger, I guess you could say. Sephiroth, oh goof, God, level 50, holy jeez. And check out the equipment, you know, there's that buster sword, power wrist, we don't even have a power wrist right now. And look at what Sephiroth has equipped. I want it. I want these things. Ah, oh, I want those items. Materia we can also look at. Cloud is preemptive. <laughs> That's all. But Sephiroth, you know, it's really cool how they kind of show this to you. Uh, and you can check it out. You know, he's got revive. He knows all the life spells, you know, all the cure spells from restore. Earth? Earth? We haven't even seen that yet. What the? What is Earth? All fire, and he's got uh, all in lightning and all in ice. Yeah. You know, I always thought it was weird. Why didn't they just? Why didn't they just put something there? You know, just leave that slot. You know, empty. I don't know. It seems weird to me. Anyway, Tifa's not really officially in our party, nor is that other soldier member. <laughs> the other one's dead. Which one do you think it is? There's kind of, there's two soldier members, other than Cloud and Sephiroth, with us. One was kind of a complainer, worry war. The other was kind of like, uh, eh, hey, get out of here. Get out of my face, kid. You're bothering me. You know, talking to Cloud like, what, what do you want? Well, settle down. Stop that. Eh. So we're taking the path up. You know, it's pretty straightforward. It's pretty easy to find your way through here. It's no big thing. What's this? A mysteriously colored cave. Hmm. It must be the Mako energy. This mountain is especially abundant in it. That's why the Mako reactor was built here. Very nice. At least we're taking the scenic route. And what's this? A Mako fountain. It's a miracle of nature. It's so beautiful. If the Mako reactor continues to suck up the energy, this fountain will dry up too. Materia. 
when you condense Mako energy, materia is produced. It's very rare to see materia in its natural state. By the way, why is it that when you use materia, you can also use magic too? You were in Soldier and you didn't even know that? Hmm. The knowledge and wisdom of the Ancients is held in the Materia. Anyone with this knowledge can freely use the powers of the land and the planet. That knowledge interacts between ourselves and the planet calling up magic. Or so they say. Magic? A mysterious power? <laughs> <laughs> Did I say something funny? A man once told me never to use an unscientific term like mysterious power. It shouldn't even be called magic. I still remember how angry he was. Who was that? Hmm, Hojo of Shinra. An inexperienced man assigned to take over the work of a great scientist. He was a walking mass of complexes. Hmm? A Mako fountain. So this is where the knowledge of the ancients is. All right, we're here. Looks kind of small, doesn't it? Oh, battle. Whoops. Yeah, you can get in battles. You can get in battles. It's kind of cool, actually. And yet again, Sephiroth can fight, but you can't control him. You can control Cloud. All he can do is fight and use items. He's not going to be much good to you, as you can see. So really, is there much of a point? No. But I got to tell you, I think it's cool. It really is. We finally made it. We sure took the long way, though. Tifa, you wait here. Hmm? I'm going inside, too. I want to see. Mm-mm-mm. Only authorized people are allowed in. This place is full of Shinra's industrial secrets. But... <clears throat> Take care of the lady. Mm-hmm. Uh, 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 uh. <clears throat> Man! <laughs> Better take real good care of me then. Alright, we're inside! Good stuff! No matter how fast you are, you can't catch up to Sephiroth. There we are. Sephiroth. Alright, so we're gonna go inside, we're gonna check things out. Who knows what we're gonna find? It's gonna be pretty crazy. This is Genova, right? It won't open. This is the reason for the malfunction. This part is broken. Cloud, close the valve. Did you close the valve? Hmm, why did it break? Hmm. Now I see Ojo, but doing this will never put you on the same level as Professor Gast. This is a system that condenses and freezes the Mako energy. That is, when it's working correctly. Now, what does Mako energy become when it's further condensed? Uh, um, oh yeah, it becomes materia. Right, normally, but Hojo put something else in there. Take a look. Look through the window. 
Hmm? Ah! What is that? Normal members of Soldier are humans that have been showered with Mako. You're different from the others, but still human. But what are they? They've been exposed to a far higher degree of Mako than you. Is that some kind of monster? Exactly. And it's Hojo of Shinra that produced these monsters. Mutated living organisms produced by Mako energy. That's what these monsters really are. Normal members of Soldier? You mean, you're different? <sighs> oh. hey, hey, Sephiroth! N no. Was I? Ah! 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 Was I created this way too? <sighs> ah! Ah! Am I the same Sephiroth. as all these monsters? Ah! 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 You saw it. All of them were humans. Human? No way! <sighs> Ever since I was small, I felt that I was different from the others. Special in some way. But not like this. <sighs> Am I human? I didn't really understand what Sephiroth meant then. I was even more surprised that Shinra was producing monsters. Damn, Shinra! The more I hear, the more I hate him! Who would ever have thought the Mako reactor held such a secret? That would seem to explain the increase in the number of monsters recently. I think we should listen carefully to Cloud. Don't you think so, Barrett? Why are you talking to me? Let's save the game and rest. Yeah, maybe so. Want to take a breather here? So this is a nice opportunity to save your game if you so wish. Tifa, were you waiting outside then? Hmm. Yes. We returned to Nibelheim. Sephiroth confined himself to the inn. He didn't even try and talk to me. Then all of a sudden he just disappeared, right? We found him inside the biggest building in Nibelheim. The villagers used to call it the Shinra Mansion. Long ago, people from Shinra used to live in that mansion. Mm. Mm. Mm hmm. What's Sephiroth doing? There's nothing that'll harm the town, right? Why? Why do you ask? The Shinra showed up to eliminate any information that could be embarrassing to the company. You pick these things up when you travel as much as I do. There's nothing that'll harm the town, right? No way. It's Sephiroth. He would never do that. Hmm. 
Oh my, you sure do have faith. Until we know there's no danger, we're not moving. Tifa's father is such a hard ass, man. That guy. I tell you, that guy. Anyway, this is the Shinra Mansion, now that we're really going in. You know, I gotta tell you, I find it overrated. Maybe back in its prime day, you know, people used to live in the Shinra Mansion, apparently. It could have been nicer. It does look kind of old, really old, abandoned. People don't really live here anymore. I don't know. Definitely lost its uh, luster. Anyway. We need to find Sephiroth, and it seems he might be around over here. There's no sign of Sephiroth, but I know I saw him go into this room. Oh? Uh -huh. well, if you need some help, you can always get Mr. Finger out! Get those red arrows. A little secret there. Secret passage. Man, I wish I had one of these in my, like, house where I was living. Who doesn't want one of these, you know, with the big circular staircase? It just goes all the way down and deep, deep underground. You know, where there's skeletons and chains hanging from the walls. <laughs> oh. That's very nice. An apparently dead organism was found in a 2,000-year-old geological stratum. Professor Gass named that organism Genova. X year, X month, X day. Genova confirmed to be an ancient. X year, X month, X day. Genova project approved. The use of Mako Reactor 1 approved for use. My mother's name is Genova. Genova Project. Is this just a coincidence? Professor gasped. Why didn't you tell me anything? Why did you die? Let me be alone. So Sephiroth is doing a lot of research, as you can see. Kind of like a science laboratory thing going on down here. A lot of books, a lot of information, a lot of knowledge. A lot of crazy contraptions. Research experimentation stuff. Yeah? Well, he wants to be alone, so let's leave him alone. <sighs> Sephiroth didn't come out of the Shinra Mansion. Hmm. He continued to read as if he was possessed by something, and not once did the light in the basement go out. Alright guys, I'm going to call it a wrap right here. If you enjoyed this part, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And of course, leave me those comments. Tell me what you think. I'm Dave the Usher for the Game Replay. Stay tuned for the next part of Final Fantasy VII. I will see you guys next time. I am out.